channel my name is violet thank you so much for clicking don't forget to subscribe to this channel next to it there's a bell make sure you hit that bell so that you get notification every time i upload a new video so before i get to today's topic i did a video the other day that i went to the boys if you've not watched that video please head over and watch it um but before that, uh, for those who are asking where is Du Bois, Du Bois is in town on your way to River Road. There's a castle there somewhere called Du Bois where you get all your uh, jewelry, earrings, necklaces, your uh, beauty products, your detergents. You know, you get there at affordable price. Like things are very affordable down there. And it's popular and known but for those who don't know where it is you see when you are at Odeon or commercial you can get to the boys using Odeon or commercial so me i'll give you direction from commercial from commercial going down this chain and don't go behind uh Tuskis imara then you continue going down there's like another street we are, we are looking at your left going down there's like another street and then there's like another street i think that third is it the third or the fourth street just go and check it's written du bois you will see it when you enter that street there is where you'll get all that you're looking for okay so i hope when you're in town you don't get lost if you just ask someone but be careful who you ask okay i will show you it's not it's popular like i said so in that video there's food i ate uh uh kale ugali and uh, beef and i showed you guys and i told you it's freshly cooked uh it won't affect me in any way because i have a problem when eating out i really need to be careful and the only thing i eat when i am out is fries and soda or maybe grilled chicken that's the only thing i eat out and i am aware of that so my sister convinced me and told me this place is these people are very clean and uh, they cook every single day so it's freshly cooked it's like a kibanda where they cook every single day so she convinced me and i was like yeah let's go and try it's okay i am hungry i'm stuffing and i want something to eat you know uh i've been singing this song and you guys have been you've been following me if you've been watching my videos you know i talked about me not eating in a hotel like before like back in 2018 i used to have like ulcers so uh i stayed away from beans kale you know things just the things to give me acidity i stayed away from them and i was like in and out of the hospital every two weeks there's no cure for ulcers so the only thing they give you is antibiotics for you to take for like two weeks and then i used to like go back go back so i decided i don't know i didn't decide but i think i cured it and because ulcers maybe don't have your tomb right so okay I, I was just like taking lemon water every single morning every single day and then magically i just find myself like eating these things that i was not eating so make on a two maybe it was uh cured it's gone so i don't know uh, it's been a really tough year for everyone. I can't say if I say I've not been stressed, I'll be lying. I've been stressed like you guys, like seriously stressed. Kabisa, 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 kabisa. It's been tough. <laughs> it's been really, really tough. And maybe my answer is back. I don't know. I've not gone to the doctor yet, but I am planning to go. I will insert that picture here somewhere so that you guys see what i am talking about like it was that bad and my stomach just grew it it grew guys it looks like i am pregnant my sister ran and bought me you know i took it but my stomach was still growing to a point i thought it's going to burst 
like what just happened you know like why did i eat then i said i started crying because i don't i know i have a problem with uh restaurants food why did i even go and eat because it's painful it's growing mikubwa uh i don't know because the only thing i could think of is you know so yeah i'm planning to go and have it checked just to make sure it's answers and then if it answers i'm going to cure it the only way i know and this is the reason why every time you see me traveling i always go to airbnb because i know i have a problem and i want to eat my own food like know how it's cooked i try my super best to stay away from spices i don't uh do <laughs> Sorry about that guy, someone was knocking. <laughs> I was being called outside. I washed my duvet so imeanguka. So yeah. Uh so like I was saying, I don't eat royco. The only spices I eat is uh cube and uh maybe black pepper. Other spices I don't eat. So for me, I really need to know and see how my food is cooked before I eat it because of Milena Mimi feel like it's very painful you never understand unless you're going through the same thing so you know i can't eat thank you i don't want to eat like i want to i'm hungry but then i have to eat i start suffering so i try i try to stay away from food i to stay away from food that's the only thing I can say. For hotels, it's because I think maybe they store their food in, in the fridge for a very long time. And then when maybe you order, even me in my house, I don't store food in my fridge for that long. So if I cook like today, every single day I have to cook fresh food. Every single day. Um, and if I eat naibaki, I have to make sure I eat him naibaki kesho like minimalize so that i don't keep it in a, in a fridge and eat it later in case there is food in my fridge as and it has stayed for like two to three days i can't eat i can't eat that food evil. that's how bad it is so that's why if i'm going to eat again in a restaurant or in a hotel or if you see me out there in a hotel eating I'll be eating only fries and maybe grilled chicken. That's the only thing I can eat in a hotel and feel safe. Okay, food, food, real food, food. No, rice, garlic, because I'll have to eat vegetables. I don't know how they've been cooked. I don't know how long they, they stayed in the fridge or something like that. Even uh, right now, it's not about them be, being stored in the fridge for a very long time uh, because even the one I ate the other day, it was freshly cooked the same day so i don't know if it's oil i don't know if they put roiko in that meat i really don't know but i just have to be careful okay so uh that's it for today you guys and leave me a comment down below i love to read your comments you guys i love when you correct me when i do something wrong i'm never upset with you guys i just love reading your comments i love uh correcting my mistakes so don't just watch and go leave a comment me correcting me you know i am not perfect and i make mistakes all the time so if you watch and go without saying without pouring your heart out i won't know so please I love reading your comments. So comment. What a watch of Nanda. Why are you watching and going? Please leave me a comment down below. Yeah. So I'm going to show you guys how my stomach is on a normal day. Because you've already seen how it was. Like it grew, you guys. But right now it's back to normal. And this is my normal tummy. This is I hope you guys can see from there. This is my normal tummy, you guys. This is normal for me like this you can imagine how big it grew and all that was gas 
inside my stomach. And then it was pumped down Like it was so painfully fired. But I went to go get checked once. Um, we found out what the problem is. And then now I'll start medication. Curing it the only way I know best. Because, yeah, that is really bad. I can't continue like that. Okay? So, yeah, I'll see you on our next vlog, guys. Comment, like, share, subscribe. Okay? Bye.